Welcome back, everyone, to more Ace Attorney with me, Rem, and Dave's also here, but who cares? No, wait, Let's hey, go. Ho, hey, ho, hey, <laughs> Let's be fair now. <laughs> All right, a, fine. I'm feeling a little hostility coming from your end right now. Well, good! You should! <laughs> <laughs> okay. Go. Um, we're, go, go. When we last left off, Dave is trying to figure out the victim's name because he doesn't know the victim's name. Well, so wait, he, he, I mean, the character doesn't. Anyways. Do, do you know? The judge is going to ask you if you know the victim's name. Well, it was a test <laughs> and <in> study. <laughs> I, um, just forgot. Temporarily. Uh-huh, yeah, sure. I think I feel a migraine coming on. Ugh. Got Advil or something on you? Alright, look. The victim's name is listed in the court record. Did you get that court record? Just press tab to check it at any time, right, okay? Cool. It's tab. There you go. There's all your evidence. And hey, everything. there we go. Cool. You, you can also push the R button to check the profiles of the characters involved in the case. It didn't do anything. You gotta open the court record first and then push R. Hey, there we you go. go. Hey, there's all the people. You got Mia, you got Larry, you got Girl. Wait, it said he's got... not... Didn't it say he knew Larry for 23 years, but he's 23? Yeah. Has he known nope. him his entire life? <laughs> they were in the same emergency room. They were birthed at the same time. <laughs> it's no, like two me. babies I, I, looked I, over each other. Our first moments of consciousness, and we were already connected. <laughs> Yeah, no, I, I've had this same thought myself. I've, I've replayed this game dozens of times, and I always thought that that was a little weird. They've known each other 23 years since birth. <laughs> Do you get it? Do you get the pun, David? Most of these people, their names are puns. See, it's Winston Payne. Get it? You get it? Winston Payne? Yeah, I, I, it's, I got it. I'm not responding. Oh, you at home, you didn't get it. The pun is wince in pain. Kind of like, ow. Ugh. That hurt. <laughs> Just making Hilarious. sure we're all on the same page. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I remember to check it often, all right? D do it for me, please. I'm begging you. Oh, God, oh. I think I picked... I might have hired the wrong guy. I'll do it for you. <laughs> Stop fucking sipping over me! <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Wright? Uh, <clears throat> do you, uh, you know who the victim is in this case, Mr. Wright? Yes, please. Stop sipping oh. for Miss Faye. <laughs> the victim's name is Cindy Stone. Wait, yeah. Mm, correct. You get the pun, David? Cindy Stone? You, you get it? <laughs> For those of you watching at home, I am rolling my eyes very hard right now. I love this game. Now, tell me, what was the cause of death? How was she viciously murdered? She died because she it's was... Yeah, the object. She was struck once by a blunt object. Wait, once? You sure about that? Sure about that, Chief? Well, according to the autopsy report. Correct. Wow, very good. Would you like a key, maybe? How about a gold star? You the may man... take a trip to the treasure box for answering my three questions correctly. The treasure box, yeah. Dude, it's <laughs> like the guy who did the autopsy is the same guy who did the autopsy on, like, Epstein and JFK. Just a whole line of conspiracies. You're like... Well, I don't know if I trust this case. She was more high profile of a, of a woman than I thought. Oh god, I smell. <laughs> I need a shower. You've answered all my questions. I see no reason why we shouldn't proceed. So let's get a move on, fuckhead. You seem much more relaxed, Mr. Wright. Good for you. <clears throat> well, <clears throat> thank you, Your Honor. Because I don't feel relaxed, that's for sure. Oh, man, he's... This guy's on, on edge. Yeah, well then. <clears throat> uh, let me check. Diaper is good. Yep, tie is in order. First question. First A question for the prosecution. Mr. Payne? Yes, Your here. Honor. Oh, God. Uh, as Mr. Wright just told us, the victim was struck with a blunt object. Would you explain to the court just what that object was? So what merity weapon was this statue of the thinker? 
It was found lying on the floor next to the victim. God, my glasses are getting a little fogged up. There we go. I just gotta clean it out like that. There we go. It's good. Oh, where'd I put my inhaler? <laughs> I, I see. Well, uh, the court accepts it into evidence. It, right on. Look, we got the statue of the thinker. It's it's rather heavy. Yeah. <laughs> Great notes, whoever wrote that. It's like the dude well, who collects the evidence and logs it is just a complete, total idiot. It's like... <laughs> hmm. What this do I need feels to put heavy. In? I'm going to write that down. I'm sure that's helpful. <laughs> I don't think they would have figured that out if it weren't for my notes. Man, my mom must be so proud of me. <laughs> Anyways, guys. I'm a special little boy. She says I'm a special little man. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, guys, I'll be back to the chess game in a moment. I'm going to go get some milk. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Just It's room you temperature. Know. Nice and warm. <laughs> Just how I like it, like mommy used to make. <laughs> okay, right? I need you to look me in the eyes right, okay? Sure. Mm -hmm. Be sure to pay attention. Any yep. evidence added during the trial Absolutely. is very important. Yep. That evidence is the only ammunition mm -hmm. you have in court, okay? Well, it's not the only ammunition. I may or may not have a 9 millimeter on me. Plus, uh, Slowly nod if plus you understand me. Might have a couple of knives, <laughs> bow and arrow... Half How did you sneak that shit in here? Did Don't you not go to through security? <laughs> um, right. So you know how we're doing a trial right now about this other dude. You know the security <laughs> guard Harold. There may or may not be a trial coming up about his untimely demise, which I had nothing to do with. Nothing to well, do with at all. Well then, great. Let's hope they don't pick you for that case. <laughs> they pick me for my six. own murder case. You want to you keep scrolling the text or we're going to be here for hours? I know. <laughs> Just have to check you out. Have... Shut up. <laughs> yeah. Look, I want to tell you the controls! <laughs> Shut Mr. up. Mr. Payne, the, the prosecution may call its first witness. The prosecution calls the defendant, Mr. Butts, to the stand. <laughs> <laughs> it's like everyone in the courtroom just kind of giggles to themselves. <laughs> Someone in the jury's like, he said Butts. And they're just like, <laughs> he said the B word. <laughs> Such a naughty boy. So they're like, they're passing notes. One of them's just like, I made you a note. And he passes it to the jurors. And they're all looking at it. It's just, it's just a dick. Just like. <laughs> they're all just smiling they're just <laughs> laughing at it as they pass it along <laughs> the judges uh, they pass it up to the judge he's like mm, very nice I can see the detail that would make so jury duty so on it. <laughs> <laughs> um chief what do I do now uh be a lawyer <laughs> pay attention do your damn you job miss any information that might help your client's case You'll get a chance to respond to the prosecution later, so be ready. I'll be ready. Let's just hope he doesn't say anything unfortunate. Ah, <coughs> uh, Larry gets excited easily. This could be bad. He's just gonna run his mouth off and blow the whole case for us. Ahem. <laughs> Mr. Butts, <laughs> is it not true that the victim had recently... Dumped you. Well, uh, hey, watch it, buddy. Like, uh, we, we were we were great together. We we were Romeo and Juliet, Cleopatra, and Mark Anthony. <laughs> uh, didn't they all die? Uh... <laughs> and, and I wasn't dumped. She just wasn't taking my calls or, or seeing me ever. Like, what's it to you anyway? <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Butts, what you describe is generally what we mean by <laughs> dumped. Fucking <laughs> loser. In fact, she had completely abandoned you and was seeing other men, you cuck. <laughs> she had just returned from overseas with one of them the day before the murder. Jeez. 
What, what do you mean, one of them? Lies! All of it! Lies! I don't believe a word of it! You liar, liar, pants for hire! Your Honor, the victim's passport. <laughs> Keep this with me for just such an occasion. According to this, she was in Paris until the day before she died. <laughs> Why, why, did, yeah. why did you giggle after saying died? That's kind of morbid. <laughs> <laughs> mm, indeed. She appears to have returned the day before the murder. Hmm. Interesting. Dude. Well, like, no way. <laughs> Shit. Did he just become a <laughs> surfer, dude? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Yo, bro, check out this sex wax I just got on my board, brah. Whoa, gnarly, dude. Catch some totally tubulars, man. <laughs> the victim was a model, but did not have a large income. But she had some other things that were large. <laughs> it appears that she had several sugar daddies. Mm. I got a couple oh, myself. Why? Those are my favorite candies, dude. I love, like, the caramel centers. Oh, right? They're delicious. Anyways, back to the case. <laughs> Daddy's sugar. Bro. Oh. <laughs> yes, older men who gave her money and gifts. She took their money and used it to support her lifestyle while they get a little something in exchange. Oh, like a gold digger. I think my mom was one of those. Dude! She used to work in the gold mines before the explosion. <laughs> my, my dad had to raise me all on his own. He tried his best. <laughs> it's Paul of the surfer voice. Very nice. My dad had to raise me all on his own, brah. <laughs> he was quite a gnarly dude. You know, back in the day, I used to find inspiration and solace in the music of Dick Dale. I'm sorry, you, I don't, don't understand. Musical Dick Dale. Dale, surf rock. Dick Dale, that's Dick Dale. Rock? Yeah, that, yeah, you know. Is that a genre? Yes, surf rock is a genre. It's like an entire oh. thing. How did you not wow. know this? I don't know, but I do now. I learned something. That's cool. <laughs> Way to go. Fuck you! Let's just keep going! <laughs> we can clearly see what kind of woman this Miss Stone was. <laughs> Tell me, Mr. Butts, uh, what do you think of her now? <sighs> uh, right! Psst! Right! I, I don't think you want to answer that question! Hmm, yeah, Larry has a way of running his mouth in all the wrong directions. Should I... What do you want to do, man? Okay, I'm gonna be- call. I'm gonna be that guy because... The truth is the truth, the chips fall where they may. If Larry wants to get- Larry wants to get fucked. What? He's your client, dude. I, you gotta I get know, him off the hook. But like, I, I'm not gonna censor him. I'm a very advocate. I'm a strong advocate for you know free dialogue. All right, man. You I wanna be a sound, shitty lawyer? No, I client. do. Just no. I'm. Just tell you what. I'm such a good lawyer. No matter what he's gonna say, we're gonna salvage this. All right. You wanna make life harder for yourself? Oh no. <laughs> see, might be better not to be involved on this one. Well, Mr. Butts. Dude, no way! That cheating she dog! Like, man, bruh. <laughs> I'm gonna die! I'm just gonna drop dead, bruh! <laughs> just you watch! Yeah, and when I meet her in the afterlife, like, I'm gonna get to the bottom of this, man! Yeah, that was, see, uh, that wasn't so bad. <laughs> bro, let's, uh, let's continue with the trial, shall we? I'll give and you a we, hint. It doesn't matter what you picked. It would have just, he would have said that anyway. Oh. Well, we're going to continue with the trial next time on Remedy. Really? Really? We're not making any progress. Should we make these no. episodes a little longer, maybe? No, or we should probably actually just stop 
goofing off and actually yeah, maybe stop making around and making jokes and bits. Let's just not do a show. Let's just read to the people. All right. Next time oh. on Rubbin Day. All right. We'll see you then next time. We should do that. We should read uh, Go the Fuck to Sleep. Oh, my God. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Narrated by Samuel L. Jackson. Just our, our dulcet voices. Just going, please. Go the fuck to sleep. If you guys want that on Rem and Dave, comment now and we'll do ASMR. <laughs> our our tier two Patreons will get to listen to us read them a bedtime story.